everyone so we've got a bit of a vlog today um i'm at downtown summerland and i thought i'd go out to lunch i'm by myself <laughs> i'd actually text my friends and asked did they want to go to lunch today but they're all busy so no worries so i thought well i still want to go to lunch so i'm here by myself i'm gonna go see if they got a space for me at true food do a cheeky little try on inside the, the fitting rooms of H&M and here I am trying on this green dress which normally I wouldn't but I thought hey I'm not paying for this I'm going to try on and just try on anything that's out of my comfort zone and you know what I actually really like this although I do think it is just a wee tad too short for me but I do love that colour and I actually really like that style what do you guys think yes or no Next I tried on this really beautiful green dress. Now it's completely see-through so I wasn't going to buy it. However, this is one of my favourite colours to wear. I used to have a suit I bought absolutely years ago in Debenhams and it was this colour and I used to wear it with a white t-shirt. I just adored it. But um, that colour drew me in and I tried it on. I would have bought that if it had not been so see-through. Now this dress also is out of my comfort zone just because of the bold pattern. I've never had a dress I don't think with such a bold pattern on it. It's really really comfortable though and I really like the fact that it's a bit lower at the back than the than the front. Um, what do you think guys? Do you like this or not? Let me know. Now I really like these linen shorts. These were in a size large just wasn't keen on this colour. Um, it gave me mushy pea vibes. <laughs> um, yeah, they were super, super comfortable and if they had them in a different colour, which they did have several different colours in this style, just not in my size, I would have bought those. So yeah, that was a shame. However, the black linen shirt I really liked and that was a size medium and I think that was $30. This was a really thin knitted top, so it was actually really cool to wear. I like the slit. I like the big scoop at the front and the back. Um, yeah, I like this one. I think it was $12.99. Now this linen top is the same as the black one. It's just, I think it was either one size or two sizes larger than the black one. It was really nice, but I, I preferred the black one, I think. Now this dress here is actually the same style as that bright green one that I tried on earlier. I was really drawn to this colour and the pattern. I just thought it was so nice. And I thought with it having that large pattern on it, it wouldn't be so see-through. But unfortunately, it was... So I ended up buying three items out of the um, items that I tried on. Can you guess which three items are in this bag? I wonder if you get it right or not. I'll show you when I get home. Guys, I got my hair did. It's still light enough. I think you can see I got it. I actually went all over darker, just one shade, and then I got more highlights put in but I really like the way she um, blow dried my hair wait a minute where did I park oh down there so anyway yeah can't really tell because the wind's blowing it but I'm happy with it okay it is the next day I just wanted to show you what I ended up buying did you guess correctly the first item was the little sweater it was $12 and it was like a little t-shirt and I tried it on with those shorts 
So I've bought that. I also bought the black, uh, this is medium sized linen shirt. It was, I think it was about 25 or 29. Yeah, $30. So yep, happy about that. And then lastly, da, 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 did you guess? Whoop, this dress here. <laughs> So really comfy dress. This was $25. But looking back at the video footage, I actually really liked the shorter green dress. So I don't know. Do I want to buy that? Would I wear it? Was it too short? Let me know what your thoughts are on the very first green dress. It had the long puffy sleeves. Um, it was a beautiful colour. Um, yeah, I actually really liked it. Anyway, let's go off out. All right. Oh, I look very orange. I'm not orange, but I look orange in the camera. Why do I look so orange? Is that better? Yeah, I think maybe. <laughs> I don't know why I look orange. Anywho, oh, we got some big old storm clouds over to the north. Yikes. I asked Google this morning what, the what was the weather today. And she said sunny. So let's see if she got that wrong. Anywho, I'm going to go off to a coffee shop and uh, grab a coffee. Oh, it is. It's really stormy looking over there. Oh, what's going on, Vegas? So I do have to say I'm really happy with um, my hair. She did a really nice trim. It wasn't too much. I didn't need that much cut in any way, but I, I'm happy with my color. Can you see my highlights a bit more today? Yeah, I'm really happy. So... Gosh, it's really stormy. Uh, I was going to lay out by the pool today. Um, haven't done that in a while. So just go and relax and have some quiet time. Because I tell you what, most of my week has been spent either videoing or editing. Um, it's so unbelievably time consuming just to do a 12 minute video. Um, probably wouldn't believe how much time it takes. Anywho, let's go see what trouble we can get into today. <laughs> so I just wanted to show you these storm clouds. They look white and fluffy um, up front, but if you look in the background, I don't know if the video is picking up. It's very, very dark and gloomy. And um, yeah, hopefully, I think the wind is blowing the clouds away from me though. So I just stopped off to get my dog, uh, my puppy, some more um, dog food because there is only one place you can really buy it from. And whilst I was in there, I picked up this um, this toy. They've got into the habit of chewing up their soft toys, their teddy bears, really quickly. They used to last them for ages, but now they've got really destructive with them. So I'm trying to switch out their toys to these hard plastic ones. But anyway, the name of this place is the Dog Supply Outlet Store. Um, they've got, gosh, everything you can think of for dogs. Anyway, I'm off to the coffee shop. Look at the state of the back of my car, honest to goodness. Anyway, off to the coffee shop. Right, I've made a slight detour. Instead of going for coffee, I'm hungry. It's 12.06. I haven't eaten anything today. So I am by a little Thai restaurant that we've been to a few times and their food is so good. So let's go inside and see if they've got room for one, one little old me. It's called Lemongrass and Lime, a Thai Eastro. Um, so I went with the Thai basil shrimp dish. It's a little bit spicy. You can say how spicy you want it, but um, this looks like a lot of food. That food was awesome, but as you can see, I couldn't eat it all. Normally, I probably would have forced myself to eat it all, but I'm like, no, stop where you are full. I also... Okay, every time I go for Thai food, I always order a Thai tea. It's one of my favorite drinks. So I thought, you know what? How calorie laden is one of these? So I looked it up, I pulled it up on my screen, read it, and instead of ordering a Thai tea, I just stuck with the water that was infused with coconut, um, sorry, cucumber and oranges. So um, I did good. Yeah, 
I'm, I'm retraining my mind on how to order food. <laughs> Okay, so as you can see, I'm actually very close to the storm clouds now. I've actually done a little side track to Home Goods. Let's pop in there and see if they've got anything interesting. Oh, it's a little light. This is really nice. Oh, wow, 50 bucks. Not sure I'd pay 50 bucks for that, but that's really pretty. I think I found the happiest mug ever. $5.99. That's so pretty. Oh, even this one's pretty. This is really nice. It's like a chalice. It's $8.99. It's really heavy. Um, that would look really nice on a table setting if you had like a curry night or even these up here. I think they're really, really pretty. Oh, look. These little shot glasses are different. If you had a tiki night, oh, look, this one's got an anchor and that one has an octopus inside. These margarita glasses are gorgeous. I thought this was different. It has like a nice flat top to it. Yeah, I like that. Okay, we are right underneath the cloud now. It's got very gloomy looking. We just came out of Good um, Home Goods, and now we're going to go to Big Lots over here just to look at their garden selection. This is a good price. They got a little event going on at the moment, so eighty-nine bucks for this side table, but you get this big old umbrella with it. They have a whole set. That's so rinky dinky. That's really cute. It's called the Lakewood Collection. Well, Big Lots was definitely a fail, except for they did have one of those huge outdoor umbrellas that um, is like sunk into a massive base and you crank it up. That was only $167. So that actually was a huge bargain because we've got one. I'm sure we paid close to 500 for ours. Um, other than that, there was not a lot in there. They've put their prices up a lot. Big Lots used to be one of those bargainy stores that you could always go in there and find something but I can't wait to go home and show you what I got from home goods and give it a taste test honey I've been driving around in my car looking for some kind of open bar it's gonna be all right gonna be all right got no money but I'll work it out with my charm having a good time and doing no harm it's gonna be all right gonna be all right hey now honey I've been driving around in my car looking for some kind of open bar it's gonna be all right gonna be all right Okay, so I went to Hendo's and bought some strawberry rose flavour infusion. Zero calories, zero sugar and zero carbs. So this is part of the skinny range, the skinny syrups, right? Hibiscus and passion fruit. Same deal, no calories, carbs, uh, sugar. They were $3.99 each. Now, if I went down to the international food market and got myself like a bottle of orange juice, I'd be paying $4 for that. So, well, let's give this a try. I'm pretty sure that these syrups are meant for like alcohol, but I think I could drink them just like orange squash. Oh, that sounds good. Cheers. That's good. So that's the hibiscus and passion fruit. Mm, that's refreshing. Ellie, what are you doing? Are you being naughty? Are you being naughty? I hear you chewing something. It's no good standing there wagging your tail at me. Little miss. Little missy poo. What, you want some of this? You want to come say hi? Say hi to everyone. Hi. Hi. <laughs> this is Ellie. <laughs> I cut her hair really short when it gets hot. She's a King Charles Cavalier. That's why she looks a little bit different. No, this isn't for you. I always cut her hair short in the summertime. Ooh, it gets, it just gets too hot for them. Let's do, so this one is strawberry and rose. Cheers. Mmm, this one's nicer than the other one. Mm, I could just imagine 
being at a really expensive spa and then bringing me a little strawberry and rose cocktail. Both of those are good. I can't remember, they had two other flavours and then they also had some bottles of lemonade that were infused with mint. I wish I'd bought one of those too, but oh well, live and learn. Morning, it's now Saturday morning, so I'm off to go get my nails done. This time I actually called and made an appointment. Usually I turn up on their doorstep and they're like, no, we've got no availability, but today they said, come in at 9.30, so I had to suddenly rush to be there on time. I think I might be one or two minutes late, actually. Um, and I already know what color I want. I think I want to go for like an orangey, peachy color, um, only because I did my eyeshadow, it's got orangey and, and Beijing. Anyway, after my nails, I'm going to a cafe on the west side of Vegas to meet up with two co-workers. And it's a cafe I've never been to before, so um, I'll take you with me. All right, I'll see you in a bit. Okay, nails are done. Uh, I was looking for more of a peachy color, but they didn't have them. They don't seem to have that many color choices in gels, but um, I'm actually quite liking this color. So yeah, happy. Thank you so much. We're gonna get that contact. What is that? Prosciutto. Prosciutto. Oh my god. You got oh you got a yellow flower. So cute. 